Hello, I'm Daniel Canis. I'm a science editor at World Book Encyclopedia, and today I'll be talking about Carnotaurus. And Carnotaurus was one of the more unusual meat-eating dinosaurs. It lived about 75 million to 70 million years ago in what is now Argentina. It had a variety of distinctive physical traits. Most famously, it had a pair of stubby bull-like horns over the eyes. In fact, the name Carnotaurus means meat-eating bull. Scientists who study dinosaurs aren't sure what purpose the horns served. It's possible they were used for display as a way of attracting mates. It's also possible they were used in fights with other Carnotauruses. The dinosaurs may have battered each other much as modern rams do, though it's not clear their skulls were strong enough to withstand such behavior. Carnotaurus also had extremely short forelimbs, which is also a bit of a puzzle. The arms were too small to be of any real use in grasping or subduing prey. Each arm had four fingers, but the fingers were fused together and could not be moved. The fingers also lacked claws. If Carnotaurus hadn't gotten extinct, its descendants might have lost their arms entirely as they evolved. Nonetheless, Carnotaurus was probably a fearsome predator. It grew to about 25 feet, or 7.5 meters long, and it weighed between 1 and 2 tons, or between 0.9 and 1.8 metric tons. It also had a mouthful of sharp teeth that had serrated edges like a saw blade. Carnotaurus had somewhat unusual jaw structure. It could probably bite very quickly, but its bite was probably relatively weak, especially compared to other large meat-eating dinosaurs. This has led some scientists to speculate that Carnotaurus might have scavenged animal remains, at least some of the time. On the other hand, some scientists think that Carnotaurus used its stout head to subdue live prey. Carnotaurus had a relatively long neck, which it could have used to whip its skull down with great force. If Carnotaurus could whip its head down and sink its teeth into prey at great speed, it would not have needed a very strong bite. Researchers also think that Carnotaurus was a very fast runner. It had slender legs with powerful thighs, and its tail seems to have been particularly straight and powerful. These traits might have allowed Carnotaurus to reach speeds of around 30 miles per hour, that's 48 kilometers per hour. Such running speeds would have made Carnotaurus one of the fastest dinosaurs ever. One Carnotaurus fossil was an especially fortunate discovery. It was so well preserved that researchers were able to recover detailed impressions of its skin. Skin impressions of meat-eating dinosaurs, such as Carnotaurus, are extremely rare. Researchers were able to determine that Carnotaurus did not have feathers, as many other theropod dinosaurs had. Instead, its skin was covered with non-overlapping disc-like scales. Carnotaurus lived in South America with a variety of other unique dinosaurs. At the time that Carnotaurus lived, the continents were in different positions, and South America was isolated from other parts of the world, much like how Australia is isolated from other continents today. This isolation allowed for the development of dinosaurs, unlike those found anywhere else in the world, including Carnotaurus.